All right, everyone. Got to do a quick, quick little update just to tell everyone where we are. Um, we're getting ready to put the transmission in. Let's see. Our bolts are just a little too long, so we got to run to the hardware store tomorrow or fasten all what we got local here. As you see how long it is in this and see how chunky we are here. If you take this bolt and you put it right back in here, see how much further it sticks out? We need something to give it about right there with the head, you know, being flush and everything. So that's holding us up a little bit, not a problem. We have the torque converter. It was pretty much ready to go, but we found out that, like I said, the transmission hardware was just a little too long, so we are going to go get that. We have the trend. Let's see what else we got. Oh, rear end is in. Brake calipers are all on. Let's see if I can turn my flashlight on here. It's all almost ready. Everything's tight. I got to put the sway bar links back on, which I have them up on the front bumper. Everything's pretty much adjusted, ready to go. I still, like I said, I still got to put the drive shaft in. No transmission yet. That'll probably be tomorrow. But this is where we are currently. I've got a wheel on the other side just to give a little in the air of what we got. Just sitting up here. You see right through. It's a good little, little setup. Um, I ordered the ARP, excuse me, I think it's a Ford Performance hub assembly with the extended ARP hardware. I ordered that. That should be here in a day or two. I also went ahead and got the extended hardware for the front because I got to do the brake conversion on it. Put my coilovers on, which I had to get some anti-seize for. So hopefully here, let's see here, probably the next day or two, we should start putting putting her back on the ground hopefully on her feet but that's the update i got for you currently